Well, it seems Paul the Psychic Octopus was right again in his World Cup predictions for Germany, much to the disappointment of their team. I'm Noni Edwards and after the break I'll tell you how the eight-legged oracle is preparing for his next prediction. Stay with Emirates News. For the first time in their history, Spain are heading to the final of the 2010 FIFA World Cup after defeating Germany. Noni Edwards has the update. Last night's semi-final match saw Germany versus Spain. The outcome was an unhappy one for Germany and its supporters. Carlos Puyol scored the only goal of the game to send Spain into the World Cup final where they will rival Holland. I am a bit scared but I think we are better than Holland but a bit scared because it is only one match. The Barcelona centre-back powered home a header 10 yards from Xavi's corner, 17 minutes from the 90-minute whistle to send the reigning European champions into their first ever World Cup final. Spain coach Vicente del Bosque had sprung a surprise before kickoff by dropping out of form Liverpool forward Fernando Torres and replacing him with Barcelona youngster Pedro. The move allowed tournament top scorer David Villa to play through the middle and the switch almost paid dividends six minutes into the game. Pedro came in off his wing and slipped a delightful ball in behind the Germany defence, which Villa ran on to, but he had to slide in to shoot before Manuel Neuer arrived and he succeeded only in prodding the ball into the goalkeeper's chest. Germany was stretched again on 19 minutes as a cross ball from Zabi Alonso found Sergio Ramos, but after an exquisite piece of control, his shot was wild and high. Germany finally threatened on 32 minutes when Piotr Trakowski, in for the suspended Thomas Müller, shot from a distance and forced Iker Casillas into a sprawling save low to his left. Spain was struggling to get into the box and started hitting shots from distance with Alonso twice and Villa shooting wide. 69 minutes in, Germany created possibly their best chance of the match, as substitute Tony Cruz arrived unmarked at the back post onto Lucas Podolski's cross, but his finish was weak and straight at Casillas. Then came Puel's great leap to propel Spain into the final. It's a shame. A shame I would have been happy if we would have made it into the final. The final of the 2010 World Cup, which will be held on Sunday, means there will be a new name on the trophy for the first time. Paul the Oracle Octopus, who predicted the match correctly, is getting some rest now before he makes his final predictions on Germany's match for third place. If he gets it right, he'll keep his 100% success rate for the tournament. Noni Edwards, Emirates News.